everyone, welcome back to another Destiny video by your boy XL, and you clicked on this video because you want to know everything there is to possibly know about the up and coming beta for the game Destiny 2. Now let's kick us off straight away by saying if you want to get early access to the beta you have to pre-order the game, but however if you do not want to pre-order the game you will still get access to the beta but it will be at a later date from when the early access kicks off. So say about a week after the beta goes live for the people who have pre-ordered and gained early access. Now the beta will also be available on all three platforms, that's including PC now as well, so you've got PS4, Xbox One, and PC. So if you're going to pre-order the game to get that early access, there's a few ways to do it, and there's a few ways to get your code and redeem it and stuff like that. So jumping in straight away if you want to pre-order the game from an online retailer like Amazon or EB Games or GameStop, something like that, then you will be sent a nine digit code via your email that is linked to the account that you purchased the game off. So if you're on Amazon, it will be linked to the Amazon accounts email and you go on there and you just get the nine digit code and then you will then take that code over to bungie.net where you'll go into their code redemption page. There'll be a link in the description down below if you guys wanna go over there. If you do have that code to redeem it and it basically just you copy and paste the code in and then it will say you're all good to go, you've got your beta access ready, come back at a later date and you'll be able to choose which console you want to play on. Now, however, if you've gone into a physical store to pre-order your game, then you will either be emailed the code just like from doing it online or they will print the code onto your receipt for pre-ordering the game. And then again, you just take that code over to bungie.net into the code redemption portal that the link in the description down below will take you to and there you go the same thing will happen you'll get to come back at a later date and choose which platform you want to play on now the last way to pre-order is doing it online via the first party store so say the PSN store or the Xbox Live store so if you go on and pre-order it that way you don't have to do anything you just have to come back on the day that the beta launches install the beta and then just jump straight in and start playing now, if you want to play the beta on PC and you don't have an Xbox Live account or a PSN account to link to your Bungie.net account to redeem that nine digit code, then Bungie is saying that you're going to want to hold onto that code and not use it just yet. Wait until they update their website so that you can link a Steam account or whatever they want to go with for selling their game on the PC. And with that being said, make sure that the PSN that you are wanting to play the beta on is linked to the Bungie.net account that you're going to redeem that nine digit code on. Otherwise, you're going to put it on the wrong account and you're not going to get to play it on the right one that you want to play on, if that makes sense. So when is the beta actually going to go live? Well, according to Bungie, it will be sometime during the summer in America. So for us Australians, it's going to be during the winter. And if we can look at the original Destiny beta, it went live on the 17th of July for PlayStation players and the 23rd of July for Xbox players. So I guess we can expect something similar to that for Destiny 2's beta. And with Destiny 2 having exclusive content for PlayStation players, I'm guessing that they're going to get even earlier access from the Xbox players on top of the early access from people who don't pre-order. But however, we will most likely be getting more info about the beta and possibly the launch date of the beta during the gameplay reveal stream that is happening on May 18th. And you can expect a lot of content and update videos from that stream right here on this channel when it does go live. And along with that, we might also be getting some extra details on the beta tomorrow on the 25th of April, according to this leak from GameStop employee, where it says that they will be getting new promotional material for Destiny 2 and Call of Duty World War 2 tomorrow on the 25th and that might have some extra details about the beta including a launch date but anyway that is all the details that I have about the beta for you guys today that is basically everything that we know as a community so far but I'm sure we're going to be getting a lot more details about it up until the launch of the beta so definitely stay tuned to this channel and remember to go ahead and follow me on Twitter where I'll be also posting new updates as soon as they come out over on there there will be a link for that down in the description as well. And expect a lot of content from me from the gameplay reveal and when the beta launches and everything in between about Destiny 2 and Destiny 1 before that game dies off. So if that's what you guys enjoy, then definitely drop a like and subscribe 
if that's what you want to do. And just before I say goodbye, if you guys want to have a look at some stats from the original Destiny beta, then there will be a link in the description as well to an infograph from the original beta with a bunch of different stats about how many people played and different things that went on in the beta. But with that being said, we are at the end of the video, so definitely drop a like on the video and hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. It really helps me out. And I love you guys, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.